You guys, I am finally moving my snake plant into a bigger container. Um, I did not realize it was going to be this big. Um, but, you know, well, I have enough space to like grow and get bigger. So, <sighs> might as well just get the bigger one now. Because this one has this right here. And it has this one here, this one. And these are growing really fast. Um so yeah and i don't know if you guys can see but this is the pattern and i purchased it from i purchased it on amazon i did not realize it didn't bring like a, a um what you call it a plate underneath it so it does have the four holes underneath um but that should be fine i'll put it i'll put something under it and I purchased it on Amazon, and the store on Amazon is La Jolie Muse. I'm not sure if you pronounce it Muse like that, but yeah. And they have a lot of cute other uh, other cute plants here, so <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna have to get another one of these for my peace lily. I'm not sure if I'm gonna buy this big next time. Should I? Let me see. Because the peace lily, I don't know. I think I might buy it a size down actually yeah um so yeah i'm gonna i'm finally gonna switch it over okay guys here is the end result it's in here already and um this is a really nice bucket it's um i like i like the material i i think it's plastic i think it's like a really hard type of plastic i'm not sure but um i switched it over and you know what i just realized this is still too cluttered and um not because of the space but because these are so like together i'm gonna do some research but i think i'm gonna have to i don't know what i don't even know the correct term to use but i'm gonna have to cut them and like because these are connected um i'm gonna have to do the same thing that i did to um give my mother one of them um and cut them and then replant them in here again, but replant them separately so that they have enough space because these are growing and they're going to, they're way too close to this one right here. And they're not going to have enough space to like grow big. And you see there's one, there's this small one, one, two, three, four. And let me see is that it yeah so this one has four so it needs more space and then this one has one tiny one in there right and then look at this it's just it's way too close right four and then this one this big one is a part of this one too so that's um that's five and then this one has one in there as well so i'm gonna have to take it out again um cut it and then separate them so yeah okay you guys so i decided to actually cut these because when i planted these in these in this big pot these i know this are going to close to are going to grow too close together these babies here as you can see they're going to they're not going to have enough space to like grow so i'm going to cut these into three and just an FYI, if you guys saw my last video about the snake plant, I did have a fourth one and I cut it off and gave it to my mother. So I'm going to do the same thing here. And all you have to do is cut as close to the bottom as you can. You have to be careful. You have to make sure that you have you get a, as much as you can of this right here. And if you don't get enough of the roots, that's fine because it's going to grow more roots. And let's see. And this one right here. And this is the one I was worried about because this one is growing babies here, here, and there's actually another one over here. And it needs more space. So now we have three mother plants. And this one, this one actually has a baby down here. So now that we have these three, I'm going to go ahead and plant them and make sure that they have enough space in here.
Okay, you guys, so I finally separated them. Um, there should be enough space for them to grow in now because this one was very, w was way too close to one, to this one, I think it was. And, um, yeah, I, I wanted to make sure I had enough space to grow. And, yeah, I'm happy. Because this one has a lot of babies. This one only has one in the middle. And this is the one that was always in the middle when they were all connected. So, um, this is the one that you saw with the big, um, with the big ball of root, with the big root system. Um... The rest did have a few roots, um, but it did have the bottom part of the plant, so they should be able to start developing a root system pretty soon. And this one has one small baby in there as well. But this one is the one that I was really worried about because it has this one, it has this one, it has this one, it has... What is it? Yeah, it has one in the back here, so that's two, three, four, and then it has one in the middle, so... I am happy. I am happy and I'm excited to see how big these get. And I made sure to buy a, uh, a planter big enough. I'm in love, 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 love with this planter. Look at this. I'm going to actually buy another one of these but smaller because I need to actually start repotting my peace lily. Um, which um, hasn't uh, given me any... Uh, flowers yet i had to cut the other flowers because they died so i'm hoping the peace lily flower gives me flowers when i repot it so yeah i will see you guys in the next video make sure to like this video subscribe and i will talk to y'all later bye